just about time he showed up. Had a bus out of quick set at 25 on his way to the Sorry, coach, I'm late. I was doing some cardio. Did you say cardio? As in leg work? Yeah. Take a lap. Take a lap. All right, boys, if you look at the uh, board right here, we got pull-ups, buys and tries in between each set, bench, buys and tries again, and as always, curls for the girls. Spring break's coming up soon. Boys, the next workout we're doing is pull-ups. Not quite as much arm action as I'd like, but still gets the job done. I'll show you how it's done. See, boys, this is how you do it. Nice and easy. All the way down, all the way up. You saw the master do his craft. Muscle Bob Buff Pants here up first. Let's see what you got. <laughs> It's not gonna get it done, Muscle Bob. Get down. After seeing that poor excuse for a pull up, I need to know how much you weigh. Uh, about 180 pounds. I meant kilograms. Uh, 82.4 kilograms, sir. Alright, well, luckily I always have my handy dandy physics equation sheet with me. Let's see how much work you need to be doing. According to the work theorem, which is force times displacement, not distance. You need to be doing at least 23.1 joules of work every time you want to do a pull up. Now let's see what you got. Oh. Attaboy! Attaboy! Ah! Oh. You got one more in you. Ah! Oh. Rising oh. I'm going to teach you how to bench now. Obviously, this is more weight than you all can do, as you can see. But I'll show you how it's done real quick. Coach, you need a spotter? No! Woo! I'm lucky. Alright, Blue Sox, you're up. Let's see, let's see how you do it. Hold on a second. Put your sleeves down, Mr. Spring Break. I don't see 14.5. See what you got. Yeah, Louis. Help him out, help him out, help him out, help him out. Let's get these two and a half off. You obviously can't move this. Before we do anything, we need to figure out how long your arms are to know the displacement of the working we're doing. About 54 centimeters, approximately 0.54 meters. And that bar's mass is 20.4 kilograms. Alright, we need to do 11.01 joules of work. Let's see you get out of here, fella. Press. Press. 3, 2, 1, tempo. Go, go, go. 3, 2, 1, press. Six. One more, one more, one more. That's one, come on. Woo! a boy. Soldier, roll your sleeves up. You've deserved it. How's that feel? Thank you, sir. It feels great, I know. Boys, this is how it's done. Boys, so, so far I've showed you how to do the work with bench press and pull-ups. Now, if you remember what we saw on the board, we had that, that leaves one more thing. Curls for the girls. Yeah. Let's do this, boys! Do you believe you can do this? Bell talk? I heard it makes you be able to do more weight, and I wouldn't question Coach. He's the most ripped guy I know. That's true. All right, boys, the first thing you need to know about doing curls always in front of a mirror. To figure out the amount of work I'm doing, can I please get a quick measurement of the displacement on my arm? 55 centimeters. 55 centimeters. That's 0.55 meters. What is that? Approximately 165 tools of work since this is 300 kilograms. Noodle. Boys, I've showed you how to do pull ups, bench press, and curls. If you guys keep doing what you're doing and what I taught you, you should be well on your way to your spring break box. It's only five months away. Now make sure you guys get your shakes from Coach Hot. Get out of here.